Jihad Telji is the trainer of Scalacci, and uh, Telji owns a pizza shop. He's a hobby trainer in the greyhound industry, and he's got a superstar dog by the name of Scalacci, who's just going to slot in uh, the Phoenix. He'll be representing Ladbrokes, but he's a big chance tonight from box one in the Top Gun, after basically being the last dog selected in this invitational race. And uh, Telji joins us here. How, how are we, mate? Tell yeah, good, boys. Welcome good. to the show. Um, how are you feeling before this Top Gun? Uh, mate, nervous, excited. It, it's all in one, you know, like, it's been a big week. Um, you know, the boys came out to the shop last week and we did a photo shoot with the kids yeah. and the family and, um, yeah, it's just exciting. So, tell you, I just met you for the first time tonight. Tell us a little bit about your story. How'd you um, get into the sport? I'm good mates with Glenn Rounds. We've been friends for 35 years. We played footy together when we were young and... And back then, rounds he was training, and, and me and my cousin Alex would always go to the tab and bet on the dogs and stuff. So we thought we'll get one, and we ended up approaching Glenn, and we got a dog off him um, out of just the best Brooklyn doll. And the dog was called Culver City, and he ended up training it for us, became a good dog, won a few city races. Um, and that's how it all started. Got the love of the sport, and, and you know, the. And just the rest is history. There. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, Telji. Uh, Give us a little bit more insight on Scalacci. We hear stories sometimes of greyhounds that break in okay and then continue to improve. <coughs> Did he always show you that he was going to be special? He, he broke in. Grant Fortin broke him in. Um, did a great job. He only had three runs with Grant because he was a bit of a tail wagger and and um, he had a bit of an affected tail. And Grant said to me, he said, look, he's got one more run, but his tail's bleeding and... And I said, just let him go. Just bring. I'll get him home and I'll fix him up. And got him home, gave him two months off, fixed the tail, put him around Ballarat first look. Never been there, like first, you know, trial after breaking in and went 17.72. And I thought, wow, what's going on here, you know? Yeah, from the puppy boxes, obviously, that's yeah. very, very quick. Um, tonight, that early speed battle that everyone's talking about, box one, box two, Alpha Zulu, Scalacci, you did run five seconds even to the mark at Sandown. Uh, what, are you, what are you hoping for tonight, obviously? 495. <laughs> <laughs> Is it capable of that? Oh, look, any, anything's capable, but a bit of a breeze here today. I don't know if it's a headwind or a tailwind, but he's just got to nail the start. I, I, I'll be honest, he, he won't win from behind. If he hits the front early, untouched, he'll show his best. So how many dogs have you got in work, Chelsea? Two. Two dogs. Yeah. And you own a pizza shop. Tell yeah. us where your pizza shop is based. It's in Caram Downs, Hall Road. Just around the corner. I'm starving <laughs> here. Does it do Uber Eats? <laughs> As I said to you before, mate, if, if I win the Top Gun tonight, I'll get the missus down. She'll pick yeah. up 50 and bring them back here. What, what's the specialty? <laughs> We're going to have to have the Scalacci with the lot if you Scalacci win the Top special. Gun. Yeah. <laughs> um, so he wins tonight. Yeah. All right, You win a Top Gun. He's won... 10 races, nearly close to $50,000 in prize money. You win tonight, you win $150,000. That'll buy a few pizzas. Mate, I won't be making pizzas. <laughs> <laughs> and then you can win a Melbourne Cup worth yeah. a million dollars. Well, and then you would have done a great deal with yeah, Ladbrokes. Yeah, the all Ladbrokes have come on board and yeah. it's great. And the you Phoenix, know, of course. Yeah, Ryan was fantastic. He came out to my place the other day and we sat down and chatted and, and spoke about everything and he was just you know, really good and yeah, and, and they've, mate, they've put, you know, they've put up the money and, and taken the risk with a young dog that's only had 15 starts and it's credit to them that they back the young blokes in, the, you know, the, the small people, so it's good. A lot of the greyhound trainers, and I find this fascinating, they reward their dogs with a McDonald's um, soft serve, there's some that like a cheeseburger, I know a couple like a, a McChicken, some um, yeah, yeah, some nuggets. Yeah. Does Scalacci like a pizza? No, um, I haven't tried him with a pizza yet. Okay. I'm just a bit worried that he'll end up liking it too much <laughs> and he won't race. You know? <laughs> but speaking of McDonald's, I always, after every race or trial, we stop at McDonald's and get a soft serve. Yeah. So. And but they love it, right. don't they? Oh, mate. They just... I couldn't believe that when someone told me that. Yeah, yeah, all the time. McDonald's should be sponsoring Greyhound Racing. They should. Yeah. Oh, um, Tells you, hey, it's some story, mate. I love how you're living your dream. And Scalacci's drawn box number one. Did you name him after the champion race horse? I did. I'll tell you quickly just the story. That the, My favourite horse was Hariba. Yeah. Now, the mother, when I first started racing her, or before I raced her, I tried to get Hariba. And they said to me that I couldn't get him. They didn't say why. They said I couldn't get the name. I said, no worries. So I put flying in front of it. So I called her Flying Hariba. And then when this dog come along, I thought, I've got to try and get Hariba again. So I rang <coughs> Greyhounds Australasia and they said, no, someone's reserved it. I said, oh, okay. 
So I said, what about Scalacci? Because they were my two favourite horses. Yeah. And she said yes. And, mate, I jumped off the couch <laughs> that happy because I knew I had a good dog yeah. and that I wasn't going to name a dog Scalacci yeah. if he was no good. Got to give it a good name. Yeah, yeah. you got to. It's a special horse. Now it's a special dog. And, and the good thing about it, I went to Adelaide for the derby and all that, and they all loved him there. They just yeah. I don't know if it was the name or just the way he raced there, but he's become the people's dog, you know. Yeah. He really has. Yeah, he's the special dog with the special name, and hopefully he can have a special victory tonight in the Thanks, Top Gun. Good on you, Telgy. Yeah. Thanks, guys.